what goans used to think that drugs are being smoked by indians and foreigners tourists. but the yeah tu tourists were coming here. but the trend has changed today it is goans who are getting uh, affected all coastal boys lot of coastal boys i'm not saying all lot of coastal boys and girls are already consuming drugs and we cannot hide this i had a group of more than 100 men and women in my office last week more than 100 amche goyekar majhe office an ele sir what are you doing about drugs umtawado kalangut jinga bandutkar statue at the side both the side maddawado umtawado ani side cha wado te wadetle sogle like minded people who first time they said we are come out from your house and we are expecting that you will do something you from 7 o'clock onwards there are boys and girls coming in gullies they are coming they are standing they are sitting in one corner they are injecting themselves they are smoking drugs so they are in the evening they are going around to buy that and they are doing that on the road side or where the lane ends or under a banyan tree so these things have got pe penetrated into the goans we were thinking that it is outsiders who are smoking or injecting no now it is goans you mean to say our local youths ja college yes. vata school yes. vata yes they have started taking this are we going to be serious is the police department going to be serious is the government going to be serious on this how are we going to stop this but if this happens in places like kalangut kalangut it is there i cannot deny i am the mla i cannot say there so why is not police say. not booking any single i am i have spoken to director general of police over the phone and i have told him that we should visit kalangut kandolim baga look at these activities and see how you are going to stop these activities how you are going to control these activities and then stop he said he is ready to come with me so we are going to come not officially with jeeps or something like that. and officially definitely but we what have to stops police from taking action why See, the gps you, there, to come there in are check? drug peddlers i don't want to name it in front of you there are drug peddlers in this belt i know their names because i have got people who give me information and these drug peddlers are still selling drugs in huge quantities they are selling cocaine they are selling white they are selling cheras ganja everything they are selling everything everything is available injections Uh, ecstasy tablets everything is available but situation situation is no nope. till today the police are raiding small time people small time they have to raid these main dealers who are who are sitting with kilos of uh, drugs and selling them yeah, so the every day they are consuming you tell me these boys and girls the goan youth plus uh, foreigners plus indian tourists are consuming it every day so they are easily available situation is uh, worse now yes the it has gone to a uh, limit it is cross the limit that is why the local people came to me i'll put it in that way that is why the local people came to me otherwise they wouldn't have come they are worried that their own children may be infected or already infect means they are they have habituated or they already gyopak lagle man think they beyala ki apli burgi ya itun padot o padpache ha o padlya then na jena congress time are drugs jatale pa that time home minister was blamed ata why you are not blaming home minister who See, incidentally happens to be chief honorable chief minister i'm so totally against drugs he has given free hand to the goa police Action all the department be. even good officers are brought over there azuni start jangna ye maka dukh ka lagta and if you ask anybody in kalangut belt or any other belt in goa where tourism is there even in mandre belt or anjuna belt or, they will say yes drugs are available drugs are sold or drugs are available but action jai na ki dyak jai na shri sir maka he dista ki somewhere we have to be more stricter the government has to be more stricter with the police for special je tenji uh, ek force a ड्रग्स एंटी नार्कोटिक सेल हेज टू बी रिवेम्ड गुड ऑफिसर्स हेव टू कम इन दे हेव टू हेव टू हेव मोर मैन पावर दैट इज पुलिस पावर पुलिस इज ऑन रोमिंग ऑन द कोस्ट विथ प्लेन क्लोज टू फाइंड आउट हू आर द सेलर्स हू आर द डीलर्स दे नीड टू स्टॉप दैम दे नीड टू कंटिन्युअसली रेड दैम
Okay. Uh, I will, you will come to know how serious the police will be because I am going to give names to the uh, police department. The, the so called sellers in this belt. These are not small sellers, these are big sellers. Then chair raid continuously marung that till they understand that the police are raiding them. You mean to say you, you are going to give the name of drug of course, peddlers, drug sellers? Of, not peddlers, these are sellers. These are these are sellers, these are not small sellers, these are sellers who are specialized in one one particular type of thing. Yeah, uh, are there any politicians in that? No, team? no, no. Let's be very frank, there are no politicians involved. There is no backing to this type of people from anybody. Are they Goans? Yes. All are Goans? Yeah, most of them are Goans. So, why are they No, no, no. Why are they peddlers? These are, they are bringing quantity, giving it to them. Okay, so we can wait for a big uh, expose? No. See, government has to put the foot down and police have to act. Chief Minister on order Dilya, on the floor of the house, he has said, no drugs in Goa. I will not tolerate drugs and prostitution. Which is not getting implemented. Implementations of So now them. you will force them to implement. Yes. Okay, back to politics. Uh, you don't sound to be happy in BJP. And state executive meetings are there. You don't mean that. No, state executive meeting. I was out of station. One day before I, at night, I, I had a program which was, uh, I had taken three months before as a chief guest in Karnataka. I, I was in Bijapur. But that was also important for you. Yes, I had taken a, I was a chief guest. No, state executive was also important. No, but state executive was told to me four days prior. No, because what happens when there is a name, your name coming up, you know, that you are trying no, to topple the government. Like as far as I am concerned, I am with the BJP. I have won on the ticket of BJP. The, uh, the core committee of the BJP was in my favour to give me the ticket, though there were other aspirants also. They knew that I was with BJP, not now. Six years This is my seventh year with BJP. So, there I talk, I am vocal. That is why some people feel that I am not happy with the uh, government. I have to tell what is wrong now. You mean to say I should keep quiet that there are no drugs in Kalangut. That means government will be affected. drugs Finally, uh, drugs drugs I am so government. I am not saying BJP is involved. No person should think that I am trying to say that accusing my government. I am not accusing my government. It is the, uh, the, it is the police who have to act. That is why I am talking. So if anything is wrong in this, some people say I am talking against the government. I am not talking against the government. Kalangut constituency was a Congress stronghold. Suddenly uh, BJP won you. Was it because of Parikar's wave? No, uh, people were fed up. Even if you look at all, uh, some people were saying like this is a Congress uh, fort which was always with the Congress. This time, all the uh, coastal belt, especially the Catholics community voted for BJP. They said you cannot take us for granted. Congress party che je amdar ahle, tinka, tinka koan ele ki tinka granted gyung na lokang. But this BJP is a vote, so when you vote, mm -hmm. they retain it. On, on one hand, uh, people were fed up of Congress because yes. they were not working. Not working, no. They were involved in corruption. Drugs had totally gone up. Prostitution had totally gone up. All limits had, had, had crossed. Is the same? No, no. See, if you talk about prostitution, we are continuously reading, we are stopping. If anybody starts activity, we stop. So there is control on prostitution. I will, I will say drugs, yes. I will say that till today the police have, are not working to stop. But you uh, uh, retain the vote bank, what are your attempts? You are also not are a BJP president. I am working. I am working for my constituency. I am working for my people. So they have seen my work. What we have delivered for the last uh, 15 months, people have noticed that. Not only in Kalangut, I have done it in Parra, my village, Arpara, Nagwa, Kalangut, and I am also doing in Kandalim. Kandalim also work has started from Nerul side, uh, Kandalim, uh, uh, Nerul River, Hatinga. Soon come start Zalna. Any main other Bicharu Yami start Kurpaja Hakam. So people have seen my uh, work. I am a BJP MLA, so they have seen. So finally, the, those uh, people whose works are getting done or 
and development works are getting done the credit goes to my party uh, tourism minister has asked 400 crores from the center you think how much of it should come to your constituency if the money comes then i will ask you think it won't come ruling ko tak congress ho gaya you tell me for the last one and a half year how much money has come from the center and why they are not sending that also i will tell you 80 crores je elle poili titutle kitle boishe modle for tourism sector we had got around 11 crores in baga 5 years jale ata kamut start jaina tina i am start kela ata tourism minister ak force karun i said the money we will have to send it back otherwise it is come for a special purpose to develop the baga land it is tourism land at baga so they he laid a foundation stone and we we started the work ata puni atle paisa ka yojana paisa according to you state finance yes amche budget no 400 crores that is up to tourism minister how he follows up how he uh, goes to the center and presents his uh, case his file his project with detail project report and they may ask i'm just saying they may ask what have you done about the earlier money has it been spent give so us the certificate from the north goa collector or collector uh, who is whoever is their uh, person here who looks after this funds utility certificate means utilize the funds or not okay it has come for some purpose if it is be- being congress government and other ani hui modle to shambhur amka ille ikra koti te ani hui modle inga modukut na okay last question you are running short of time for people to know is it that there is some understanding tumcha madhi ani joseph sequera madhi ki ya term ak apun rautlo ani after 5 years when next election comes he will contest on bjp ticket see joseph sequera is free to contest and if bjp gives him the ticket i will support joseph cautionally doesn't arise he supported me when i got the ticket if joseph sequera is given bjp ticket i will support him but there is no understanding that i will vacate no, for you no it is not a question of understanding i am already there joseph is a aspirant he is a good friend of mine he is also doing lot of work for kalangut but if he gets a a t- ticket you will support him i will support him okay with this we end our interview we have with us michael lobo mla of kalangut constituency according to him we should give little more time to tourism minister to perform and prove his ability he says that some works are being done in kalangut constituency because of inter- in- intervention of chief minister manohar parrikar who has taken up uh, some issues one important issue and which is very sad for us to know that uh, amount of drugs that's happening in kalangut and coastal belt it's still the same he says it's increased and now he wants the help from police to track down all those big wigs and uh, very importantly he is going to give names of all those big wigs to the police department for a crack down and one of the most important thing he clarified that he won't be a part of any toppling game he is little unhappy with the state government is only because he want government to perform better uh, thank you very much for joining us here you are watching counterpoint your own interview series on prudent on every monday at 7:30 9:30 pm keep watching prudent